the numbers. The numbers, please. What do they mean? Hi and welcome to the Tinkering Seal. So what do all the numbers in the Meisterstück series mean? Well, today we're going to take a look at it. There are a few different sizes of Meisterstücks. To begin with the small one, we have the Mozart. Next we have the most common one, the Classique. Third, we have the mid-size. And then we have the Le Grand, the big one. There is also one size bigger than the Le Grand. We'll get to that further in. By the way, this leather pen case is made by my friend Antonio at Coyo from Italy. He makes different leather goods handmade with excellent stitching quality. If you'd like to know more, take a look at the link in the description down below. To get to his uh, shop, you can also email him if you have any questions or to make a special order. Also, you can use the code TTCL10 to get 10% of your whole purchase. So let's get into the different numbers. Some of the fountain pen numbers have been used all the way from 1949. Specifications have changed over time. This walkthrough covers the most contemporary models. The first one in our series is the Mozart line. Model 114, it's the Mozart fountain pen. It's a cartridge only because it's too short to use a converter. Instead, it used these regular cartridges that is common used for all fountain pens. The size is 113.1 millimeters long and 11.7 millimeters in diameter. Next is the 116 Mozart ballpoint. It uses these small ink cartridges. The length is 105.8 mm long and 10.4 mm in diameter. To go along with the ballpoint, we have the 117. This is the mechanical pencil. It uses these 0.7 mm lead refills. This is only available in 0.7 mm size. The size is of the pen is 109.2 mm long and 10.4 mm in diameter. Last of the Mozart line is the 118, the rollerball. It uses a shorter version of the rollerball refills. This is the only Meisterstück with threaded cap posting. The size is close to the fountain pen, it's 115 mm long and 11.7 mm in diameter. Next up is the 140 series. All fountain pens except the Mozart fountain pen is found in this number group. The 144 Classic fountain pen. This is a cartridge or converter pen. The cap is a snap-on and it was later replaced by the 145. The length is 136 millimeters and the diameter is 12 millimeters. The 145, also known as the Chopin fountain pen, is also a cartridge or converter pen. It has a screw-on cap, which is the easiest way to difference it from the 144. Though it's slightly thicker and longer than the 144, it's 140 mm long and 13.7 mm in diameter, it was later renamed the Classic after the 144 production was ended. Although, looking at the size, it's more similar to the mid-size ballpoint pens. 
the 146, also known as Le Grand. This is a piston filler for bottled ink. The versions with resin barrel have ink window, so you can see when the ink level is running low. The length is 145.8 mm and the diameter is 15.5 mm. Identical in size is the 147 Le Grand Traveler. Instead of the piston inside the pen, you have room for two cartridges, one to use and one for replacement. From the outside you can see the difference in the ink window. The 147 does not have an ink window. Last of the fountain pens is the 149, also known as the Diplomat or Le Cigar. This is a piston filler for bottled ink and it's the biggest one with the size of 147.3 mm long and 17.3 mm in diameter. Moving on to the 160 series. First we have the 161. This is the Le Grand Ballpoint. The size is similar to the fountain pens, 147.9 mm long and 15.5 mm in diameter. This pen uses the regular ballpoint refills shared with the classic size and mid size. 162 is the Le Grand Roller Ball. It's similarly sized to the fountain pens. It's 145.3 mm long and 15.5 mm in diameter. Screw on cap and it uses a thicker version of the roller ball refills. This is a special Le Grand Roller Ball refill. So make sure you get the right one when you're replacing your refill. 163 is the classic roller ball, usually with a snap-on cap, although some of the Douai versions have a screw-on cap instead. This uses the regular size roller ball refill. The size of the pen is 136.9 mm long and 12.5 mm in diameter. Next is the 164. This is the classic ballpoint. The size is 137.1 mm long and 12.5 mm in diameter. It uses the same kind of ballpoint refill as the Le Grand and mid size. Next is the 165. This is the classic mechanical pencil. It has the same cap and same barrel as the 164, but the interiors are different. This specific model is the Ultra Black that I converted in a previous video. You can find a link to that video right here. This is available in 0.7 or 0.5 mm LEDs. It uses the same standard kind of LED refills. The size is very close to the ballpoint. This is 140.2 mm long and 12.5 mm in diameter. The extra length is the tip of the mechanical pencil insert. With the 166 we go back to the Le Grand. Similar size to the Le Grand roller ball. It's 145.3 mm long and 15.5 mm in diameter. It has a snap-on cap and use a broad felt tip refill. The same size as the roller ball, but they're not interchangeable because the tip of the pen itself is different. Next is the 167. This is the Le Grand propelling pencil. Unlike the mechanical pencils, this is a constant turn to extract the lead, and this is a very thick 0.9 mm lead. The 0.9 is the only size available for the Le Grand pencil. The size is 149.3 mm long and 15.5 mm in diameter. And last, the 169. This is the Leonardo sketch pen. It uses a very thick 5.5 mm lead refill. The size is a short 123 mm 
but it's 18.5 millimeters thick. Then what about the midsize? Well, this was released after Mont Blanc stopped giving three digit numbers to the different series. It is only available as a ballpoint and the size is 141.7 mm long and 13.7 mm in diameter. Because of this, the, the 145 Chopin has the same diameter as this mid-size ballpoint. And I think the 145 should actually be named the mid-size fountain pen, not the classic. So with this guide from the baby size to the classic to the mid size to the Le Grand, I hope I have given some clarity in the sometimes confusing numbering of the Mont Blanc pens. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Also click that bell notification button so you don't miss any updates. Take care, stay safe, bye bye.